I'm Dr. George Fischer. I'm a physicist. I work as a space scientist for more than 20 years. I actually used to be, you could say, the, the weatherman of Saturn for more than a decade or so. Because usually, you know, the radio antennas, they receive the radio waves, and then the data is transmitted via this high gain antenna here. Yeah? So you send the data to Earth, then it's received by the deep space network, and then the data, in our case, because the instrument I'm working on, the radio and plasma wave science instrument, was mainly built in Iowa. The data goes to Iowa, it's decoded, it's processed, and at the end, we look at a data product we call, uh, in our case, dynamic spectrum, which simply gives you the intensity of a radio wave as a function of time when it occurs and the frequency. And in these spectra, we can see, for example, this Saturn kil kilometric radiation, but we also can see the radio emissions from lightning, which are really short bursts. And then most of the time, actually, I was the first person to detect lightning on Saturn, to see a storm coming. And what I did then was actually informing other people, like the Cassini imaging team, where we had many dedicated amateur astronomers that uh, looked into the sky with their telescopes. And actually, we found white spots in Saturn's atmosphere with a size of about 2,000 kilometers, which were related to these Saturn lightning radio emissions. So I was the weatherman of Saturn for a long time.